So today's video is going to be a new episode of the new makeup releases series. It's going to be episode 5. So let's just get into it. Just opening something that pertains to this video on my phone. So let's just get into it. Odinzine have their jeweled shadow collection. I was like, these are single eyeshadows. And I was like, wow, this looks amazing. Like, they look amazing. Like, they look amazing. Swatches, I can see. Look amazing. They look amazing. I will leave a link to everything down below. Then, Colourpop have their Wink Luxe collection. Which, I actually thought looked pretty good. I liked the look of it. I liked how colourful it was like uh, it was a collection I uh, like there's a just like magic pressed powder palette six ultra lip glosses in the shades boom stella flora aisha tikna and musa three light sticks Literally obsessed individual face crystal jewels. If I've said any of it wrong, I do apologise. Because I know I've probably just said some of them wrong. I think the palette looks really colourful. Like, I do like the look of it. Those shimmers look amazing. Like, don't need any more lip products. Don't really need any... Don't really need another highlighter, but... Interesting. Talking about the Charlotte Tilbury highlighters, they're now available. These highlighters do look good. Two look exactly the same shade. I won't be getting them, I've got a highlighter. But there's the Pillar Talk Glow, Rose Gold Glow, Moonlight Glow, Champagne Glow, Sunset Glow and Bronze Glow. I do like the star print, but I'm not really interested. Next we have... A lip gloss with SBF, new Make It Pop Sun Gloss by Black Girl Sunscreen. This looks interesting, this is Sun Gloss for protected glossy and popping lips, formulated with broad spectrum SBF 50, hyaluronic acid, and that does seem really interesting. Like, though I do have plenty of glosses, though it does look interesting. Never heard of anything like it, so looks interesting. Urban Decay have their new concealer. This is their 24 hour multi hydrating quickie concealer. This is hydrating full coverage, a multi use one swipe full coverage for on the go that gives you a natural skin like finish for up to 24 hours helps to minimize the look of dark circles acne blemishes high pigmentation discoloration and redness a waterproof lightweight formula with a matte finish has a doe foot applicator for targeting and precision and a buffing brush there's 24 shades And will launch in all stores soon. So, personally, I'm not really looking for a concealer, but it does look interesting. Like, I do like that full coverage look. But it's good that it's a natural finish, so... Looks very interesting. Sugar Rush have their Sweet Tart Craving eyeshadow palette. I was, like, so intrigued by this. Like, really intrigued. Like, ah! This looks amazing. Like, it's neutrals, but there's a wide range. Like, I really like it. Like, there's nine neutral everyday shades, warm and taupe bronze shades, and shimmers. Like, wow, this looks amazing. Looks like a box of chocolates. Like, I love it. And we have Makeup Forever have... They're Rouge Artist Velvet Nude Soft Matte Lipsticks. There's seven matte shades for 
every skin tone and undertone with moisturising hyaluronic acid 10 hours wear there's soft blush soft rosy nude warm mucker warm coral nude tender nude rosewood nude cozy taupe deep caramel nude comfort brown mauvey chocolate nude fluffy rosewood warm berry nude then there's like a cheerful gonja terracotta nude there's also the hourglass satin cream lipsticks ultra hydrating lipsticks with a satin finish and this is like full coverage has like a sleek gold case and it's quite an oily formula has like fused with mango seed butter avocado oil argan oil the formula conditions for soft smooth lips comfortable wear weightless formula personally i'm not really that interested like i'm not really into like satin oily finish lipsticks like this is a middle little lip gloss like one more i'm more into like really like matte finishes like really like matte lipsticks like lipsticks like this that are like really like they dry down matte and they're like guaranteed to be like transfer proof like those are things i really that's what i like in a lipstick so i'm not such a fan but I've wanted to try something from Hourglass for a long time. Really want to try that their face palette. Because I'm kind of curious. Then next, staying on the topic of lipsticks, NARS have their new formula of lipsticks. These are their new Air Matte Ultra Lip Tints. This is a lip tint as opposed to a lipstick. These are a comfortable matte lip colour in a gel light formula, smooth, soft focus, matte finish that feels light as air, long wear, transfer resistant, colour perfects your lips are up to 8 hours and there are shades like Dolce Vita, Gone World, Muse, Sex Kitten, Showstopper, Turn On and those are the shades. Next wet and wild have their new pampered valentine's day collection this definitely caught my eye when i was looking on trend nude this includes eye and face palette lip mask and lip scrub glosses makeup sponge makeup stick blush illuminating body glow illuminating face mist and a hair clip Personally, this isn't really for me. Like, it's not my thing. Will be available on the 15th of January on Ulta and Amazon. The colours look quite generic. Like, there are also colours I already have, so I'm not really that interested. Like, it just kind of seems a bit boring. So it's not really my thing. So, I'm not interested. NARS have their healthy radiant skin they have their like reflecting multi-action treatment lotion ultra hydrating refreshing lightweight gently softens by removing dead skin cells and smoothing and moisturizing light reflecting firming serum strengthens and firm while Minimising the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles with fine spun gold pearl spheres to add a prismatic effect for skin. I do apologise if I've actually said that wrong. Because I'm like, it does sound wrong. Light reflecting moisturiser, a lightweight gel cream formula with intense moisture that leaves skin soft and radiant. Then there's the light reflecting eye and lash gel. Gel formula. 
revitalize and refresh the eye area with intense moisture while improving the look of under eye bags and then MAC Cosmetics have their Hyper Real Serum Skin Balancing Hydrating Serum. Balance, retexturizing and strengthens the skin barrier for a soft, radiant skin. Hyper Real Fresh Canvas Cleansing Oil. Dissolving all makeup including long wear waterproof and transfer proof formula. Hyper Real Skin Canvas Balm Moisturising Cream strengthens and protects the skin's barrier smooth skin and leaves a healthy looking glow. Mm, I'm not really interested. Like I kind of just have the skincare that I stick to and kind of repurchase and I've kind of got enough so I'm not really majorly interested but next is the Black Opium. This is their Floral Boutique Vanilla Carter Coffee Accord. I don't normally talk about perfumes. This is a warm vanilla perfume complemented by iconic coffee notes and sensual boutique of white flowers creating a unique and desirable bold floral fragrance. And this I, does sound quite interesting because I do like vanilla and fruity. Like I've got kind of a fruity floral scent. Like I like them mixed together. I don't just like floral on its own. Like it's not something I'm like majorly interested when it's on its own floral. But I do like them mixed together or just fruity on its own. Black cherry is one of my favourite scents. Next we have the Sephora favourites. Next we have the Sephora New Year sets, the Year of the Rabbit. Online Sephora, Canada, Canada coming to the US. So, Lunar New Year, Year of the Water Rabbit. This one has a lot of skincare stuff. Bryson Sacola, Vitamin C Rose Oil. Cladilla, not going to pronounce everything because I definitely cannot say a lot of these things. But these are all their different sets, which you get a bunch of mini things, mini products to try. So if you want to try some of these products, these sets are quite interesting. Coming soon, which I saw last at the end of filming my new makeup releases series last week is the Laura Mercier new real flawless weightless perfect foundation in the photo it only shows like one shade and this is coming soon I'm gonna be doing a video talking about like foundations I'm like interested in so that video I will talk about like foundations because there's some foundations I really want to try so I'm quite excited for that. So now we're going to talk about some Lunar New Year collections. So we're going to start with Pat McGrath. They have their eyeshadow quad, Volastic Vinix Maintenance Rouge under eye blurring powder. So, not really interested, like the palette kind of looks quite boring. The shimmers look good, but it's kind of boring. Their lipsticks don't look like anything I don't already have in my collection, so I'm not really interested. And I've got two powders, so I'm not really interested. But McGrath are kind of yet to interest me. So now we're going to move on to Max Lunar New Year release. This one looks a lot better. Like I like the look of this one more so there's the eight pan eyeshadow palette there's their lipsticks there's russian red intense blurish red chili warm brick red looking like wealth mid-tone yellow brown top of the list mid-tone yellow pink extra dimension skin finish beaming blush pink that reeks gold 
Show gold, peach that breaks pink. Glow, play blush. Heat index, bright pink. So natural, gold, beige. Oh, they have the mix. The Fix Plus MAC bottle in red. And that's the MAC stack mascara in red. I love this collection. Like, I don't know if I'm going to get anything, but I do like this collection. Like, ah, it's amazing. It's probably my favourite Lunar New Year collection I've seen. Like, I just like seeing it all in the red packaging. Like, now moving on to Anastasia Beverly Hills. They have some new shades in their lipsticks, lip glosses and lip liner. Lipstick shades, there's a warm taupe, taupe colour, hush rose, hush pink, honey top, blush brown, sun baked. Their lip gloss shades are soft pink, deep taupe, taupe. Finally might have figured out how to say that word <laughs> that I've been struggling to pronounce the whole time. Goldie, Sunbakes, the lip liners, Caramel, Mocha, Muted Mauve and Rosewood will be available the 9th of Jan on their website. So, I'm not really that interested. I'm not really into like nude shades. They don't really suit me. Then we've got cool packaging from ZZ Cosmetics. This is their Planet Press Powder setting powder. They have a planet imprint. Like, amazing on the packaging. Hydrophobic, nice feature in the powder. Soft focus, natural shimmer. Never tried a powder like that, but it doesn't have like actual shimmer in. There's the Tom Ford perfumes. There's the Cherry Smoke, which is a wild dark cherry. The original Lost Cherry which is my thing, black cherry, I like them. And there's electric cherry, which is floral fruity cherry. Like, so I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Everything will be linked down below, along with my social medias, if I can fit them in the description box. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in another video. Bye.